We're at the home site now of Johnny Mazell, one of the local residents here. Uh, Johnny is a, a middle-aged man that, uh, as you can see, he has nothing left. His house was completely destroyed. He has quite a story. He tells me that his pickup truck was outside this house. He heard the tornado coming. He went bursting out the door, jumped in his truck to try to run away from it. And in the process, it just, he met the storm. I was sitting here watching television and trying to see it, and it was cutting in and out. My brother called me and said, you need to get out now. I jumped in my old truck, went down the road, probably three, four hundred yards, I looked back, my house was gone. It's the only thing I got left, bro. Yep, it's the only thing I got left. All said and done, we okay. We're still here. But Johnny came to me and he was sharing a story of how, how, you know, all this was just taken away from him and how he was just devastated. And I said, you know, when you got Jesus Christ, can't nobody take that away. He says, I've been thinking about that. And I said, Johnny, if you want to know Christ, we can help you find Christ. It's not a complicated process. You know, if you confess with your mouth and you believe in your heart that Jesus Christ is Lord, and you know he's alive today, and you really believe that and pray that prayer, you can have Christ. And with tears flowing in, he says, I want to know Christ right now. And we prayed that sal salvation prayer, the son of prayer. And he repeated it after me with tears just flowing. And when he finished, you could just see the joy, the change in his face. That, hey, I've lost everything, but I've got Jesus now. And he knows when he opens his eyes after death, he's going to be in heaven. He has that certainty now. And that just changed his whole life and his outlook. It just won't our turn to go. And won't for this man. Yeah, it's most prayers of helping us out, and I sure appreciate it. Yeah. They, they've been a blessing. Two kinds of people come to these storms. That's people that need help and people that need to help. And we met up together. That's what it's all about. And uh, God kind of commanded us to find anybody that needs to know Christ and tell them about it. Uh, just trying to be obedient to Christ and find the person. You're the first one here, and I hope you're not the last to find. That's right. And it won't be.